Hey, what's going on guys? Little Danny B here and today I am starting a brand new series on my channel. This series is City Skylines. City Skylines is a better version of SimCity in my opinion and it, I've got it for about 15 quid so it's a really good deal and I've played a few hours of it and it's really really good but let's get into it. As you can see I've got these maps here, these are just ones I've downloaded but we can choose any of these we want I'll just go with this one. Oh, do I want that one? Um, this one. So we'll call it Littleville. Um, start. Right, I'll be back when the game loads. Alright, so we are back. This is my square of land that I can build on and stuff. It's quite a nice, flattish area. We've got the river. Um, and later, I think this grows, or you can buy land, because I remember buying some land on my other world. But, let's get into this, uh, so we need to build some roads. And what I usually do is, get in close. For some reason when I get in close, um, whilst recording, I get these random lag spikes. But, shouldn't be too, too bad. So we'll do that like that. I do have a first person mod and um, auto bulldozer mod they're just because well the auto oof, the auto bulldozer mod um, basically if they're building it burned down or um, I should build a road here if the building gets burnt down or what is it now? abandoned that's it um, I won't have to uh, demolish it, the game will do it for me. Right, so this road right here by the way is going to be my like industrial road and stuff and then this road's going to be my main road. So we'll just do that go. We can waste all the money now. We'll do that to let's get it on. There we go. Right, so then we have to build some electricity places. That was the worst description ever. So that will cost nineteen thousand dollars, should we say, or pounds? I don't know. And then we'll put right. So which way is the water going? That way. So you want to do? You want to put your? Oh, we got some. Congratulations, first power player. Yeah. Right. So we'll put. This here, this is what you want to do. Put your. Oh, what's this called anyway? Pumping station. Put that there, and then. You want to have your water drain further down. This is where all the waste goes. And then you just want to connect these two up. I want to let me select the pipes. It's because of that. Um, you do that. I like to connect them up with the roads, I don't know why. It's just because then it, I know if it will, like, if I put houses here, I know if I have the pipes going down the middle, all of them are fine. So we need these. Oh, that's already powered. I want to do that. Wait for these to turn blue. Once these turn blue, then that should disappear. And another thing I need to do put these down straight away. I put I keep them like that until I hit my third or fourth milestone. Well it depends on the city really. Look at this, it's so cool. Alright. So we've got them. Now what do we need to do? Some zones. Um we'll do some houses first. And then, some, obviously some shops, can't let the people go in a town without any shops, so put them like that. Like there. So if I'm quiet at some points, I just like to focus. So, I'm going to get some pipes. Just zoom in a minute, turn around. I really like the controls as well. 
and not like confusing um, like some other games I actually understand how the, what, what the controls are that's usually my problem in games not where you want it bloody blah yeah I know that so now we need electricity but look here there's power is that power? yeah um, certain places get power themselves but for some reason these are still saying they need power so we'll just bring over one of these anyway connect it to that wait for it to turn blue there we go and as you can see from a distance the thingies look crap I'll put it on low just so I can get the best quality uh, not quality but frame rate out of the game and when you go in further then you can see it's a lot better here a dog um, and even got the trees moving that's so cool I never even noticed that cool right um, reach a milestone what's my next well what's my first milestone population of 500 people and it tells me down here this area um, and it's telling me to bring in more houses so I'll carry this going on I'll change this to a main road eventually or something demolish all these then rebuild them again but just for now it'll do how, it, how they are now and do that so you have these different options you can have curved free form road and an upgrade road so I think that just means you can upgrade this like, I can't upgrade it yet because I don't have the ability to because I've only just started out okay, let's go on. put another one of these here my voice Ooh. hate it when that happens mm, like that them two are, yeah these two are almost the same let's get some well use this one and if you have any other mods that you recommend for me to have on city skylines make sure to put them in the description and stuff like that I'll have a look at them and I'll probably use them because I'm not bothered about getting achievements I've already got a few but it'll be alright I can get achievements another time on a different um, map or something flying car a hoax thousand there's not a thousand people here so have you noticed you can now zone industrial right, so put them over here so now we have and I also have where is it here this, well you don't unlock it yet but um, oh you unlock it at 1000 people but it's district so I could name all this a certain district but I want you guys to come up with the names if possible but what is this getting right. I'm not quite sure how this game works like with the building does it only build the like specific color if there is a demand for it or can it just build anywhere we'll speed it up I'm doing much better than I did on my last world with money. I'll tell you that. And put that there. And that covers. Enough of that. And then another one here. I'm going to try and make this a. Well, I won't, I won't say daily, but every other day if I can. Just because you guys might like to see these. And I don't want to let you get like let you down. So this is sorted. Um, let's have a look. Nothing seems to be getting built. Oh, here there is. So there's slowly getting people into the place. Um, you can build elevated roads by using page up and page down. Let's have a look at that while we're doing stuff on this where's my so page up yeah, that's a curve row let's try this one whoa oh 
that's sweet. Alright, let's use that. Some roses, what was that? Toggle snapping. But we've almost hit our 500 population thing. So I'm just going to look at this. Um, field of view. I guess I've got around 9, 10. Save config. I really wanted to look at that then, but because I had to press skip to close that down. So how do I get first person to be activated? Toggle first person is tab. Whoa! As you can see I started lagging a bit then. But it shouldn't be too bad. Hey, that was a person there. We got a bag. There it is. So I hit my um, 500 people population, and now I've unlocked healthcare and garbage. So I recommend putting garbage in your industrial area because, as you can see, I oh know this doesn't tell you about pollution, does it? Well, there might not be pollution with this, huh? But oh. I have to place this before something else gets built. Taking out the trash just became a lot easier, yeah, it did. Oh, and he also unlocked education. I don't usually see that when unlocking all the time, I'm just like, what? Right, so we've got that sorted. Oh, I pressed tab by accident. Um, Alpha healthcare. <clears throat> Let's put this bad boy in there. And I see we need some electric over here. Oh, is that not enough electricity? And one way to work around that is pumping this. Let's see if that works if not. Oh yeah, there. Lost one of them anyway. We've lost them all, but just to be sure, I'll do. Uh, oh, I kind of put this in a bad spot. So, so. No, one more. Power should come back, people. I'll do that, that'll be enough for now. I really like how the game... How the ga game? How the game is, <laughs> sorry. Um, yeah, it's a really fun game. I've played it for about 3 or 4 hours. I was just messing around with all the... Uh, mechanics and stuff. And I love how they support modding. Like you don't see that from a lot of people nowadays. So if I had a school, where would I have it? I'd have it over here. I could put it there. Before anything gets built there. Oops, sorry! It wasn't me. So that's done. Okay, what's my next milestone? Reach a popular... Oh, that's the one that I've just got. So these are all the things, so I can get taxes and loans. Um, oh no, it's this one that I want to press. Worthy village, reach a population of 1000. And I'm on 660, that's pretty good. Oh yeah, new areas, uh, new features and stuff like that. I love it how you should, can see what you unlock next, so you don't have to guess. But what I'm thinking is, 
having this all like housing and then shops here then this being the big city around this area I think it'd be pretty neat so let's bring this road down some more put curvy road on how far sorry about my phone then put it about here I really hate it how I can't get these all identical because I have that sort of OCD-ness thing. Oh no 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 no, I don't want them now. Put these. Put them in that little gap there. So, another thing that I've noticed as well, when I'm building houses, well, when I'm highlighting the place where I want the houses, you don't actually see your money go down, so that's making me think that um, you don't actually lose money for building houses in the town, which is a really clever idea. It means I don't waste all my money building a lot of houses. So, now that's gonna try to get it at least a bit lined up like that. Didn't know what that noise was. I was like, what? Over here I might put a water tower. Might be a good idea. Because it's a bit out of the way. Can okay, supply me some water over here. And then it's near to my power supply, so it won't cost that much. And I really mean it, I am doing a lot better on money than I did on my last map. I got into like minus as I got at higher and low. English is not my first language. Yeah, I had to wait until my money would go up, which was uh, quite a while. Let's speed up time again. Right. Let's see if anything, any more houses get built. Um, in the meantime, put some more here. As you can see, it spreads, which I want to know why. That's my chair squeaking. Move myself forward. I don't know why it spreads and stuff, but I ain't got a problem with it, which means less power lines. I can see a bit of this coming into the picture. So, oh no, that's not. So, I just colour this in. And then I'm going to want to extend. Pet robots are huge hit among children. Nice to know. Keep it going a little more. Whoa, I never even knew there were clouds as well. So whichever map I was on, I had the worst one. Hey, congratulations! Wavy Village, reach a population of 1,000. So I can get a second loan now. Unique buildings, fire, fire departments, police departments. I can do my districts. The mayor has worked tirelessly and now the regional government has passed the bill that allows for a larger city. Show you. Just put that there. So no. I get this out of the way, I don't have to focus on it as much. Um, no, I don't want that there. Surgery performed by robots get lost. Gets a bit annoying after a while. Um, but I like the idea. It's original. Oh, what am I doing? Right, do that. Turn over here. I could actually connect this up, like put a road there, but I like this sort of design. Do another one, which means we're going to have to save it back some 
Study. Look. I highlight them. Then it goes my thingy for me. No, you stop building in my area. Well, that was a wasted job for the construction workers then. Built a house just for it to be demolished. Carry on. I don't know how far down I want to go. This see it starts to get smaller a bit, which I kinda like. Alright, so we are back. Just hit a population of one and a half thousand people. Um didn't really unlock anything, I just put this sort of road here to end off the like the whole, I don't know what to call it, the, the road we can do districts, I got police station, fire station put in as well, because I saw fire just messed around with the uh, settings as well uh, nope that's the wrong button in uh, I don't even know what it's called, I forgot um, ah that's it First person, I slowed it down a bit so now we can see what's happening. There's a dog over there. I'm gonna find it. Please, follow these. Let's go. I'm at the end of the video now, so I just want to do an overview of my town, so this is it, we've got a population of one and a half thousand people we've got fifty nine thousand dollars in industrial estate, it's going good and we've got shops here, they're doing fine, all the houses are fine, shops here fine and let's just have a look at this, this is what I've done out of my prices um, and then if we go onto this quick, quickly look at if we have any problems this trash is a bit backed up here but that might get sorted soon what's that say? let's quickly look not enough workers not my problem, we need more people. Oh, there's a fight there. Um, education. For some reason, education. Oh, I need to turn up the, the education thing, so we'll do that now before we go. Put that up to 101. So, eligible. I don't know what that's all about. We've got a good mm, like land for wind here, so I might do a wind farm, but then that's just a waste of wind. Like, I usually do them on the coast, but I don't know. Traffic, lots of traffic around here. I might, I'm gonna do um, like heavy vehicle bands on these roads, just to make it like real life. Well, I don't know if it's like that in real life, but still. In real life, you don't want um, a lot of what you call them. I don't know. I forgot. <laughs> I literally have gone blank. But let's just turn this off. Quickly look. I'm gonna put some trees here just to block this area off. Once I've done it, anyway. Then let's quickly do a overview. We can buy these places 5,000, 4, 4, 4,500, 3,500, 3,600. I might go for this one next. It's near a big ocean, but this is two. They're both basically similar, but this one has more land, this one has more watery areas. But this is where I'm going to end it, guys. So, hope you enjoyed this new series. But until next video, my name is Little Danny B.